The following is a brief tutorial from bloodstripes.com. During this presentation, you will learn how to log in and add a new post. You will need your login credentials in order to log into the contributor portal. If you need to get your credentials, contact the bloodstripes.com team today to get set up. In a web browser, navigate to http colon forward slash forward slash bloodstripes.com forward slash wp tac login dot php. Type in the username and password that were provided. Then click the login button. From the dashboard home page, hover your mouse over posts and select the add new tab. Once on the add new post page, enter the name of your post where it says enter title here. No, this is the title of the post, not the question to be answered in the case of a Q&A post. Enter the main body of your work into the text editor. Some contributors may prefer to author and edit their posts in Word document format, then copy and paste their posts into the text editor. To create a link in your body of work, Highlight the text you wish to link. Then, click the link icon that resembles a chain. This will prompt a pop-up that allows you to enter in the web address or URL of the page you are linking to, or search the bloodstripes.com database for an existing post. Select the title of the post you want to link to from the list below. Users at bloodstripes.com can then jump in between the different material that you have authored. When responding to a user submitted question, enter the question into the Q&A post section. Now we will shift over to the boxes that line the right side of the page. On the top right side, of the Add New Posts page, you can turn on and off social media broadcasting that you set up in your profile. In the Publish section, you have the option to save a draft of your work or preview your work as it would look as published. Note, do not publish your work. The Bloodstripes.com staff publishes all material on Bloodstripes.com. The Bloodstripes.com staff ensures each post does not contain copyright material prior to publication. When you complete an article, simply post the document as a published draft. This will populate in the All Posts page. In the Categories box, Choose the type of article by clicking the relevant box. If the body of work pertains to Q&A, select that box. If the body of work is an article, put a check mark there. In the tags section, you can enter tags for the article manually, separating tags by a comma. Click Choose from the most used tags and choose relevant tags by clicking on them. Note, always manually enter the title of the article as a tag. In the thumbnail types section, choose the genre of the article by clicking the relevant box. Black is any article pertaining to the field. Dress is an article when one is wearing a dress uniform, such as during a ball ceremony. Gold is any article pertaining to when one is wearing an MOS rank insignia, such as cooks. Service is an article pertaining to when one is wearing this service uniform. In the rank section, choose the ranks the article is intended for by clicking the relevant box. In the featured image section, you can choose an image to display along with the article. 
To choose a featured image, click on Set Featured Image. Clicking on Set Featured Image will bring up a page where you can choose from thumbnails of existing images in the media library or upload a picture by clicking on Upload Files and browse your computer for the picture. In the Upload Files tab, you can drag and drop an image onto the screen or upload files manually by clicking Select Files and browsing your computer. Once you have uploaded your image, Go to the bottom right hand corner of the screen and click Set Featured Image. Now that you have categorized, tagged, and set a featured image, scroll back up to the text editor and click on Add Media. This will open a window for you to select from the media library or upload images or videos. You may choose multiple forms of media to be added to the body of text. Once you have added media, click Insert into Post. Now review your text. Once satisfied with the body of work, click Save Draft in the Publish section. Congratulations! You now know how to create a new post as a contributor to Bloodstripes.com. Thank you for your contribution to the team. Bloodstripes.com. By Marines. For Marines.